Hi everybody, Gabby from Gibbs Marketing here. We are about to be joined by one of our new special guests. So if you'll give us just a few minutes, we will get started. Hi. Hello. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. I'm excited. Nice to see you. Yeah, me too. Yeah. How, how, how's your day been so far? Good. I just did some work this morning and then I went to class and now I'm here. I'm in a library study room. So. Amazing. Are you in school right now? Yes, I'm a fourth year at Warburg College. So I have one of school forever. Oh, that's amazing. What inspired you to start your store? Yeah, so I started my store in 2020 in spring when we were in lockdown. Um, mm. so I'm actually a digital cinema major and I film weddings. And weddings were getting canceled during COVID. Um, yeah. Gather. So I didn't have a job. I was pretty bored. So I started designs. And kind of just snowballed into where it is. Um, so I didn't start it intentionally to be what it is today, but I just yeah. it and now now it's here. So that's amazing. I feel like the best businesses are started by accident because it's yeah. almost like less pressure. You're just doing it for fun, and then it snowballs into something even better. And you're like, okay, great. But it doesn't. It's not like you have the individual like this has to succeed. Like this is my livelihood. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. That's what happened. Yeah, I love that. And I was checking out your website. I love the designs. I'm definitely going to go shopping after this. Thank you. So, <laughs> tell us, how did you find Gibbs? Yeah, so I found Gibbs through a family friend, Nicole. I don't know if I can say her name or not. but um, yeah, of course. <laughs> uh, yeah, she kind of introduced it to me, and she thought that my store would be a super good fit, and I agree. Um, a lot of um, his values are sustainability, so she kind of saw um, a way with partner with that specifically but overall like um it just fits well with what I want to do as a business owner so she introduced me to it and kind of explained um what it would be for my business and for my customers and um kind of set me up and gave me some suggestions on how um it would go with Skyler Grace Co. So um yeah I found her and she's been super helpful and um it's going great. so I'm really happy. That's great. Yeah, she. Don't, that's amazing. She said hi in the chat. So. <laughs> <laughs> um, tell me, so you've had it on for about like a six, eight weeks. How long has it been? Um, I'd say, um, I'm not sure when I first started, but it's been a month, I'd say. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. So mm -hmm. what type of results have you seen so far? Did you see an increase in purchase? Yeah, so the results have been pretty subtle since it's so brand new, and I've just transitioned to Shopify as well. Um, yeah. But, so I don't really have, like, any statistics out or anything, but <laughs> um, people have definitely been using it, using it um, so that's great. And I think um, it's been a fun experiment um, trying to figure out um, what my um, average cart size is and changing that threshold because before mm -hmm. I spend $50 so we're playing with um, the average order value um, from my store and trying to see where um, to get a better return and it's been great I just my charities to be uh, more toward black history so that's something exciting and I'm ready to talk more um, but yeah and I'm also sustainable line pretty soon too so I might do switching over again to try to hit those eco-friendly charities so yeah it's been a fun like experience um and experimenting with the different um ways I can do the donations and such so yeah I love that do you feel like it added to creativity in your overall marketing process oh yeah for sure because I think like what I just was explaining with the sustainable thing um mm -hmm. like ideas for what charities to highlight and obviously the month um so like black history and Women's History Month next. Yeah. So it's going to be really fun to try to gear and like products. Um, if I want to do like being on my products for Women's History Month, um, 
also incorporate um, the different charities that kind of that cause and it, it's inspiring and creating a theme and it helps with marketing. Yeah, that's amazing. And what type of marketing does your store do? I saw you guys have a really great Instagram following, which is amazing. Great job. And, <laughs> And then do you do like newsletter marketing or how, which ways are you telling your customers what causes they can support now? Yeah. So it's mainly social media marketing, but we do do some email as well. Um, we do TikTok is a huge platform for us. Um, yeah. Facebook, but it's mainly Instagram and TikTok and then the email. So those are really only three um, streamlines, I guess you could say of how we promote right now. Um, yeah. I say we, but it's just me. Um. <laughs> it's you, you are the president of the organization. Yeah, that, that's normal. I have a friend who created like a website recently and I was like, oh, do you have a team? She's like, no, but eventually I will. So we, we use the we voice. <laughs> yes. I think it, it's like the brand, not like me. Um, Correct. Yeah. So. That's so cool. Well, I've, <laughs> I'm excited that you're here and part of the Gives family. And I want to talk a little bit more about your shop now that we've talked a little bit about our shop. So tell me, what would you have someone start with if they're a brand new customer? What's one of your favorite products or what are your customers' favorite products? I think, um, honestly, a probably probably a good t-shirt. Um, I sell a lot of t-shirts, stickers, and crewnecks, and then other accessories side. Um, I think it's a good... Um, t-shirt would be a good I kind of different design depending on the seasons so right now t-shirt would be a good one because it's older right now at least in um, yeah. summer I will do like brighter colors and stuff but I always have those on my store year round but I'd say right now like a little tea so there's several options Nicole says that she loves the teas and she loves for the crew she was just telling me that right before we jumped on because I was like I should have bought I should have bought something for the live but I was like oh well, I'll buy it after we'll do it again <laughs> I was joking with her on Slack I was like throw me throw me a t-shirt yeah seriously I love that so your current gifts offer is five percent of your order right yes I just changed it so now it's just all orders five percent so amazing hmm. yep I well it's if you guys are watching and you're not currently following, go ahead and follow Skyler so you can go shopping and get 5% back to charity. And then if anyone's watching and you have a Shopify store and you're interested in trying gifts, just send us a message. We have a special offer for you. So we would love to hear from you. And yeah, go shopping. Help us help more people shop. It's just an all-around fun project. And then we're giving back and making a difference all at the same time. Thank you so much for coming on. Of course. Thank you. And you said you were wearing something new. Do you want to highlight your outfit before we get off? I got cropped off um, when I joined. When you joined? Yeah, I know. It like, goes small. <laughs> you might have to stand up. I wore green because it gives. Um, You're but the best. It says, only claiming good energy. But the cool thing about this is that I got this from Goodwill. And then I designed this and sent it to a local screen printer. So, oh, cool. I love that. It kind of reminds me of the, like, have you, do you listen to Queen Herbie and her uh, Shocker song? No. If you haven't, that shirt will work. It's so good. <laughs> listen yeah. back to this. It matches that shirt perfectly. Oh, really? Yeah. No. Like, this little um, text, but I have a whole bunch of thrift items, secondhand items that all have this um, saying on them. So I'm going them, but they're reused. So it, they're all different and they're all different sizes, but. A local embroidery person did this and very um, eco-friendly and I'm excited it, so. I love it. Yeah. Amazing. Well, it's lovely to chat with you. I'm sure it won't be the last time. We'll share this in a little bit. So if you guys are watching and didn't see the whole thing, look forward to the replay and we'll talk to you soon. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye.